So there's a lot of YouTube compilation channels that pretty much put up funny videos or Reddit threads and they get a ton of views. But finding the content, editing, and uploading all of this would take a lot of unnecessary work. So what if we could make a computer do this all for us automatically? Uh, well, yeah, let's do it. So pretty much we're going to make a fully automated YouTube channel that can make these videos and upload them to YouTube without us having to do anything after it's made. Automated YouTube channels have actually been getting a lot of buzz lately. There's also a lot of people running scams for it, asking for like one grand to set one up for you. But nah, let's just make one ourselves with programming. We're gonna make a YouTube channel in a niche that finds the best content online, combines it all into a compilation, and then uploads the videos all automatically every single day. And if this keeps up consistently, like with daily uploads for a few months, there's a high chance that it would gain some viewers and subscribers. Maybe we could monetize it and that'd be pretty dope. But now, we gotta decide on a type of YouTube channel that we wanna make. On YouTube right now, there's actually a lot of meme compilation channels where they pretty much just take memes from Twitter or Instagram and put them together. And some of them are actually really big. But you know, as the owner of the best meme page on Instagram, I feel like their memes aren't that good and that we could do better. Alright guys, so we're pretty much making our channel about memes. Honestly, it could be for anything. But for now, let's talk about the steps that we gotta do. Alright guys, so check me out. The first thing that we gotta do is get content from the internet. And so imagine that, you know, this bag of protein powder is the internet. And what we're gonna do is get the content that we want from the internet using a program and then uh, put it into, <laughs> and then put it into the blender bottle. And the next thing we have to do is edit and make our video. So this is gonna be like our program uh, shaking up the bottle and then making our protein shake. And then our program is also going to have to upload our videos to YouTube. And this is like drinking the protein shake. And the last thing that we have to do is clean the bottle after drinking it. And this is like deleting all the files that we downloaded. All right, 10 out of 10 analogy. Now let's head right into it. So the first thing that we gotta do is scrape for videos. And there's a lot of good memes on Twitter, but it's more crowdsourced. So it'd be harder to find and download these videos. Instagram, on the other hand, has meme pages that pretty much repost any memes that they find funny. And the best ones have like 20k followers and are private. But what we can do is have a list of the best meme pages on Instagram and then scrape their reposts in the past 24 hours and then we'll have our memes. So I looked online and found two Python libraries that can help us do this. One is called Instaloader and the other is called Instaluder. So now what we can do is make an Instagram account, follow all the best meme pages, and then write a script to download all the videos posted by these accounts in the past day onto a folder on our computer. Okay, so now we're gonna code our script and I'm not gonna be going over the specifics of our code because apparently not many people care about it. And you know, this channel's gotta reach a wider audience or whatever, but I'm gonna be posting all of the code onto GitHub in case you guys wanna try it yourselves, as well as instructions on how to use it. All right, so now we're done coding and now our program can log into our Instagram account and download all the videos from these meme pages. Okay, so the second thing that we have to do is create a video compilation. We have a whole folder of videos that we want to compile and all the videos come in different sizes. So we need to make it so that they all fit nicely into the YouTube uh, 1920 by 18, fuck, 1080 frame. And to do this, we can use some programming to scale the videos into our frame while keeping the same aspect ratio. Then we can randomize the order of the memes so they don't come in batches from the same user and then compile them into one 15 minute video using a library called MoviePie. Now we can program our script and I also made a little intro video that's gonna play at the start of each compilation. Okay, so let's try it and it works. But the only problem is that it takes a long time to run. Like here it's gonna take four hours to finish our compilation. So instead of making the compilation just run sequentially or putting one video after another, we can make it run in parallel on multiple cores on our computer. What this is gonna do is make portions of our compilation all at the same time and then combine them at the very end. My CPU has eight cores, so we can make eight subsections of our video at the same time. And now let's try it. And it's a lot faster. Okay, so now we have our video compilation that we're gonna be using and it looks something like this. And in the 
little bit of spice. <laughs> Okay, so the next thing we have to do is make a YouTube channel to post these videos on. And so here I have the YouTube channel, it's called Chewy. Uh, I don't really know why it's called Chewy, it's the first adjective that came to mind. I didn't really put much thought into it. Um, but here we have a cover photo that I made and also a big Ooga Ooga profile picture. So yeah, our YouTube channel is good to go now. And the next thing we need to do is write a script to post our videos onto YouTube automatically. To do this, we're going to be using the YouTube API and on this channel, we've used the YouTube API quite a bit and it still can use some work. So Google, you guys can hit me up anytime. We're also going to be generating a description with the timestamps for each video, followed by the account that it came from. And this is going to be pretty chill to do because we have all the information that's needed from the previous parts. And to upload it, all we got to do is use the YouTube API's function called videos.insert and give it information like our title, description, time to be posted and our video. So now we're gonna code a little bit. And then, yeah, just like that, we're gonna try it. I'm gonna try posting the intro video and seeing if it works. And what it does is it logs onto our YouTube channel, uploads our video, and now on YouTube, we can see that our video was successfully published by our program. So now we got everything set up. Every day our main program is going to scrape all the content in the last 24 hours, make our compilation, and then upload it to YouTube. But ideally, we don't actually want to use our physical computer for this because this would mean that our computer would have to be on 24-7 for the program to run. So instead, we can use the cloud. When we use the cloud, we're pretty much going to be running our program on another machine somewhere else. And what this means for us is that we can turn off our computer and our program will still run every day. So I'm going to be trying to use Amazon AWS and let's see if this works. And it don't work. So it ends up not working because when we make the video compilation, it takes a lot of memory. And this is memory that we currently don't have access to on our cloud machine and we would have to pay extra to make this work. So for now, I'm probably just going to use my own computer. Okay, so we make our program run every day and then delete the files that we downloaded after we're done uploading. And on the channel now, we can see that a new compilation is posted every day, just like how we wanted. Uh, so happy, so happy. I guess, so our fully automated YouTube channel is now done. And honestly, I think that the videos that it makes are better than the ones that are out right now. So that's pretty cool. I feel like if even one person subscribed and had a good laugh, uh, then it would be pretty worthwhile making. And yeah, with consistency, I feel like the channel has pretty high potential to do well, um, but we'll see. If you want to do something like this yourself, I posted all the code onto GitHub um, with instructions on how to use it. So yeah, you guys can go check that out. And other than that, um, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys liked it, please like, comment, and subscribe, you know, do all that. Um, and yeah, you guys can hit me up on my Instagram. It's at not Nang. I post funny stuff there and like updates and you guys can talk to me there. Oh yeah. And also if you guys are into gaming or Valorant, you guys should hit up my boy Len Lin. Uh, he's a homie and he's also really good. I think he's like radiant now. So yeah, you guys should subscribe to him on Twitch. And yeah, other than that, I hope you guys have a great day and I'll see you guys hey, next Ross, time. Peace. Pull up in a riot, painted with some decals. I ain't never stopped, can't be trusting any feet.